Manchester United through to the Europa League semi-final, 1-0 win against Copenhagen. This is my match reaction. Before I do start, I'm going to have a big video on Sancho tomorrow. Sorry if I didn't do one today. The match was coming. I didn't want to like do too many videos in one day. Anyway, a huge update coming tomorrow morning covering all of it. But the game itself, Manchester United through to the semi-final of the Europa League. Thanks to that 1-0 win against Copenhagen that could have really been 4-5-6-7-0. Their goalkeeper, Johnson, he made like five, six, seven fantastic, I think 13 or 14 saves overall. Might have even been a Europa League record. Hell of a performance from him. Hell of an improvement from United as the game went on because, let's be honest, the first 20, 30 minutes, very, very poor. We started to get into the game a little bit, but defensively, we were all over the place in the first half. And it wasn't for like two or three very... Well-timed blocks from Eric Bay. Copenhagen would have got the first goal, but they didn't. And United kept going. And in that second half, I mean, Anthony Martial, wow. That really was everything you could expect of a striker in a game without a goal. And which is a weird thing to say because, you know, a goal should be the first things for strikers. And maybe some of his finishes were off, but the keeper made some fantastic saves. Especially that one where he got his right hand above his head for the Martial curler that was going into the corner. Martial with some messy like runs tonight. When he plays with flow and confidence, he's fantastic to watch. He really is frighteningly good. Marcus Rashford, on the other hand, poor again tonight. Went off with a slight groin strain. Almost surprised that Greenwood went off for one matter instead of Rashford. But Matter's substitution by Odegaard and Solskjaer, I think, changed the game in United's favour. That's what gave United the grip in possession that changed it. You know, why Mata still could do a job. I don't think he should be playing much at all for United, though. But fair play to Mata tonight. He really did change the game. If you're looking at individuals, you know, actually, as an overall point here, United need to play better than that if we're going to win the Europa League. Play like that in the semi-final. It was against Wolves or Sevilla, I think United can play. Likely things will concede. Certainly at least one. Because United tonight got lucky that Copenhagen didn't take advantage of the mistakes that we were doing and of the advantage of the opportunities that they were able to create. Do that against Wolves or Sevilla, we're going to get punished. Simple as that. But obviously, Copenhagen's goalkeeper, for me, is probably man of the match overall, given how many good saves he made. But it, he was the difference between that game being the 1-0 that it was for it being a 4 or 5-0 and a completely different match reaction. So fair play for United. We kept going at them. We kept creating shots. Bruno Fernandes from outside the box. Paul Pogba was there. Martial Greenwood. I mean, Greenwood might have got that goal ruled out for offside. But what a finish it was from the kid, man. It really is, you know, an unnaturally talented finisher. Left and right foot. On the run with the right foot. Cut it right back across the keeper. Posting in. Then we had another hit. Who is it? Bruno Fernandes hit the post. Then we had another. Greenwood hit the post. And he had a Goal ruled out for offside, and then Rashford was offside, and then their keeper made an unbelievable amount of saves. As I said, that game could have ended up being a 5 6 nil exhibition type score. It ended up being a very close 1 0 win for United, and fair play to Copenhagen. Clearly more disciplined and well drilled and better than I think we all expected them to be as the second best team from Denmark. But they deserve to be in the quarterfinals on tonight's performance. And their keeper, their keeper certainly does a raise after that individual performance. I think looking at United on an individual basis, I thought Brandon Williams up against Verrera did quite well. Then Falk came on. He was dangerous as hell. Brandon Williams did good. I think Eric Bai did well in, in a match where he was given an opportunity to actually play a couple of games in a row. He was taken off maybe because he was on a yellow card because his fitness wasn't completely there. Maybe both of them. Tactical, maybe all three of them. But Bai did well. Maguire... Indifferent performance, I suppose. And Wan-Bissaka, you know, he's really got to look up. Don't turn into a Valencia-type crosser where you just pound it across the box and hope that someone gets on the end of it. Just look up a little bit. He's got to increase that awareness for himself when he's in those positions going forward. In midfield, I thought Fred played well till he went off. Till he went off sorry. I think he can be proud of that individual performance. Not an incredible performance, but uh, not a terrible one by any stretch of the imagination. And the same goes for Pogba and Fernandes. And Fernandes, of course, it's taken me four... Four minutes and 45 seconds to mention it, but penalty FC is back again. 21st penalty from United this season. And cheekily, Fernandez adapted his run-up, didn't have his little hop and skip, and pounded it in. Great penalty taker. You, 
over recent years anyway, when United have got a penalty, you've got to watch it through your fingers. But with Fernandez on the pitch, you feel massively confident that he's just going to bang it in. And he did it again tonight. And the penalty was the thing that made the difference. But ultimately, it was Copenhagen's keeper that stopped it being that 4 or 5 nil. For me, my man of the match, I want to say Anthony Martial. I was mesmerised by his footwork tonight. And on another occasion, he would have had a couple of goals and an assist as well. But Martial, when he plays like that, unstoppable, really. And it's a real shame that he didn't get that goal tonight. Who was your man of the match? I'm looking forward to the semi-final. You know, as I said, I think if we play like that in the semi-final, we'll concede. Simple as that. We need to improve defensively. We need to improve in our ability to play with the ball in our control. Is it playing it out from the back or playing it through the midfield? We're much better at playing quickly, playing with pace. That's when United's strengths come out. But we have a clear weakness in just controlling a football game. And we have to be better at that. That has to come through the coaching, has to come through the players. The quality is there. So things have to improve there. But job done in Cologne. 1-0, United through to the Europa League semi-final. Let me know who your man of the match was. For me, it was Anthony Martial. And as I said at the start of the video, big Sancho video coming tomorrow. So make sure you have a look in the morning. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss that video. Drop a like on this video as well and subscribe if you're new for United through the Europa League semi-final. Happy days.